<clears throat> it's difficult to say um, just after the game, so we have to wait 24 hours before we can give a good diagnosis. Minim minimum 24 hours, I would say. Is it you, is it is a concern? It, yeah, yes, it is. Yeah. Dave, is it not just on, on Tony? Sorry, is it, is it a suspected fracture? Is it like a, like a potential leg break? Is, is that what, is that what the medics think or not? I can't say <laughs> in this moment. I say we have to wait 24 hours, uh, but it, it does does look good. Jeremy, sorry to continue the injury questions, but is Anthony Marshall okay? Can sort of head straight on the tour. Yes, I, I think so, uh, but uh, of course we have seen he got, he got a knock, uh, but he he continues the game and then he came off. With regard to how you played today, I noticed you said that you need to be smarter. In what way, sort of taking chances or defensively? Or? I think we ended up with two departments, uh, one attacking and one defending, a uh, big gap in between. So uh, that costs a lot of energy. Uh, it's like uh, you get a, like a tennis match. Uh, and we, want to, we, want, we don't want to play tennis, we want to play football. Uh, and um, keep the ball, uh, keep possession. Uh, recognize when to speed up and sure uh, we can go for goal we have to go for goal uh, but um, it costs so much energy also then for the back line and yeah, they also they take a lot, a lot of risk and then the front had difficulties to cut, to get back so we got stretched and the spaces are then huge and it costs a lot of energy well I, I know you said that you're not completely happy with the performance but if you're winning games 3-0 and I'm not playing to the level that you expect, that must be quite a good sign. Oh, it, it, it's, yeah, but that is the next step we have to make and we are still in the process and um, so I think first off we control the game, not playing brilliant, uh, not entertaining but we make a good goal from a set player and we're really happy with that and then we make straight after half time uh, I think a, a really good counter, that was a great goal. But then uh, um, uh, you have to play clever, uh, uh, stay compact and in possession let them run and uh, the, the spaces will come because they uh, took a lot, of, a lot of risk. So you will have your counter chances. Now, you, you've not conceded a, a goal here in the league I think, since, since Arsenal. Do you feel like you've made all up at a very, very difficult place for the teams to, to come now? I think it is. We, we, we feel strong, but we only stay strong if we do our jobs, if we do give 100% um, in every situation. And I did that, that feeling. I thought, our oh, second half, and so I had the feeling oh, it was easy going, game is gone. Eh? But game is never gone. And you, you saw the reaction of the opponent, they still believed in it. And when they get 2 1, and then they are back in the game. Samuel. Eric, how pleased have you been with Dr. Hayes' performances? Because you've had this long run of clean sheets, and there's maybe a bit of uncertainty about his position at the start of the season, but he, he seems to have become a better goalkeeper under you. Um, I think um, he performed really well, and today he had some brilliant saves. And I think you know, the, one of the um, things why we have so many clean sheets is David De Gea, because he I think of a couple of games more, great saves. I remember against West Ham United, for instance, that great save just before time. Uh, but I think in general, we don't concede so many chances. Eh? But um, today, uh, we had some clear uh, chances against in the second half. Uh, last question, Dave. Um, Eric, you're, you're now one point behind Manchester City. You're in the title race, uh, obviously. So do you feel that you are now in the title race yourselves? Oh, <coughs> that's... Uh, <laughs> That's a big step. No, um, we have to go from game to game and get the progress. And um, I think the belief is growing, and that's a good, good signal. Uh, that's um, good to have that feeling. But we have to um, uh, to to understand and that we have to give every game 100% um, energy, 100% focus, 100% play as a team. Uh, and if we keep in that philosophy, and then it's much possible, but we have to go from game to game. And don't think too much ahead. It's now January, we are not even half a season. So we are talking about um, 
Next game is Everton, different league. Uh, we have to focus on that, but it's coming quick. So um, it's enjoy 24 hours, but then move on. Thank you very much.